All right, parents, bring it in. Summer's just around the corner, and you know what that means. I'm bored. I don't know what to do today. I don't want to go outside. My name's Corey with Well Played Asheville, and today I'm going to give you four board games that aren't going to make you want to rip your hair out after you play them. Donuts for Donuts delivers a simple card game with everyone's favorite confectionery sugary treat. I mean, look at him. Look how, look how cute he is. The game is simple. Each round, players collect donuts from a central market to add to their collection. But if you pick the same donut as another player, no one gets anything. What are we talking about again? Since the early 2000s, Hava has been making some of our favorite kids games. Our personal favorite here at Well Played is Animal Upon Animal. Players take turns stacking wooden animals upon a surprisingly unagitated alligator. And when the tower does eventually fall over, Animal Upon Animal serves as a much more forgiving game than its more popular cousin, Jenga. King of Tokyo has players rolling dice to see who the baddest monster on the block is. Players can win by either collecting victory points or by smashing their opponents, or their little brother. Add a variety of powers and upgrades to your favorite creatures, and you have a game that adds a fresh coat of paint to Yahtzee's gameplay formula. Have you ever wanted to scream at a spider to defeat it? Well, in Dragonwood, you can. Players take turn playing cards in order to defeat giggling goblins and angry orcs. No, we don't know how you got that sword by stomping on it, but you probably had fun doing it anyway. Have a game you think we missed? Leave a comment below, and be sure to like, follow, subscribe, share, send us a carrier pigeon. I don't know, whatever. 